Hey now, so I've been watching all the national recaps. A little jealous I didn't go only because of seeing all the fun that people were having. Not really jealous because I thought I missed out on anything in terms of adding to the autograph collection at the show. I talked to Bill, talked to Jake, who had a great pickup. I won't I'll let him share that. But it just felt like it's no longer a show for autographs. It's all about sports cards, obviously, which is fine. That's great. Just not my niche anymore. So since my last video with the Cobb, I picked, yeah, the po Cobb autograph analysis, picked up a couple of autographs. I'm going to show those off real quickly, put those away. And then now that the national hype is going to die down probably later this week, I'll get to Mickey Cochran for those that care or are interested. So just a couple quick pickups. First one, again, just proof that autograph legibility is dead. Uh, I bought this autograph. I want to caveat is I bought this in April. I paid for it thinking that this guy, this manager was going to on his way is winning a second world series. And that's AJ Hinch. He's having a horrible year here in Detroit. I gotta be honest. It's been a letdown. Uh, if I didn't pay for the autograph, I probably went to got it. Uh, I asked him to sign his full name. Of course, the answer was no. And the other one I got, I was watching the whole run derby and this guy was just like lighting the world on fire. So I bought a full name, Julio Yumal Rodriguez Reyes. I don't know if you can see that right there. It's it's a full name baseball. If you've seen Julio Rodriguez's autograph, it's just basically a couple of loops, which is uh, to me disgusting. That's my opinion, maybe others also. And I'm like, I'm not gonna pay for that. So I paid a slight premium compared to what others wanted to get an in, not, well, uh, JSA in the presence autograph with the full name that I can read. I paid I think, 115 for that ball, and it's a little exciting only because I went back yesterday and I saw the same balls are selling. Not listed, but actually selling at 230. I know he got injured. He got hit in the hand. Hopefully it's not fractured. Hopefully, I mean, everything was, looked negative. So hopefully he's back. I know I, I bought the hype train, but I thought I'd get, get in a little bit early on that. And that's about it for pickups, besides I'm going to a lot of minor league games and picking up a lot of signed cards there from prospects. So, again, we'll get to Cochran. Thank you, everyone, for doing your national recaps. Forget autographs. I just like love looking at the floor, seeing what's going out there, seeing people together. And hopefully I'll see all of you in Chicago next year. But until then, as always, keep collecting.